These are the very beginnings of Roman Londinium. It's a hugely important town for the Romans, even when the Romans were based in Rome, across the empire. So we are learning much more about the development of, of a major city in the Roman Empire. Pottery, jewelry and tools, clues as to how an ancient people once lived, buried in what is now a very modern city. This is the heart of the city of London. You have the Gherkin over there as well as the Bank of England. And over here, you have a construction site. Inside that building site, a team of archaeologists is in the process of uncovering thousands of artifacts dating all the way back to the Roman period. Artifacts preserved in the lining of what was once an old riverbed. The deposits we are excavating are waterlogged and they have anaerobic conditions, which means there's no oxygen that gets into them. So metalwork doesn't rust, so it comes up looking as shiny as the day it was dumped or dropped in. We also have survival of things like organic materials such as leather and timber, which we'd never normally see. The find includes rare objects like a tiny amber amulet in the shape of a gladiator's helmet. Archaeologists believed it once belonged to a child. What was life like back in the Roman times? Well, we've learned that, that life in the early Roman period was pretty hard for lots of people. Um, very, very small rectangular timber dwellings thrown up quite quickly. Lots of small-scale industrial activity going on. Very busy, very smelly. Thousands of years of history. Archaeologists say there's likely more out there, lying right under our feet. Erin McLaughlin, CNN, London.